Hey you guys, this is Alan, Editor-in-Chief of EV News. Today I want to talk about a stock and about an EV company that has just arrived here in the United States. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get into it. Hey, what I really want to talk about is this stock that I wrote about over a month ago. So I wrote an article that is called The Three OTC Stocks That You Need to Own. And the first one that I talked about was DSGT or DSG Global. So DSG Global is a Vancouver, Canada-based company, and they have a subsidiary autom automotive division. And what they do is they own the distribution rights to two Chinese companies. The first one is called Zhejiang, John Wei Automotive Companies. And uh, what they have is they specialize on three and five door SUVs. They have over 500 dealerships in China and has started a distribution network in Italy. So the big one though that has me most intrigued and that has EV News very excited is Skywell. So Skywell Automotive Group is the real money maker for DSG Global. And um, it was founded in 2011 and they manufacture their own electric buses and electric vehicles. And the one car that I really like, it's called a Tian Mei. So that's a Tian is sky and Mei is beautiful. So um, I used to live in China and I can speak a little bit of Mandarin and I can read some of the Mandarin um, characters. So uh, this is the Tian Mei ET5, which I think is a very look, a nice looking SUV. And it's supposed to have a price tag of under 30,000 US dollars, which is quite exciting. Um, I currently own quite a bit of shares of this and I'm expecting and I will be holding it um, until I am able to hopefully buy a Tian Mei or a Skywell ET5. I do believe it's a nice looking car and it's coming here to the United States. In fact, that's what this video is all about today is that it is actually already here. So as of today, um, in the in California, they have officially brought all of the electric vehicles here and they will be starting to bring their electric buses. So they haven't made any sales yet, but they have all of the actual vehicles here in the United States, which is absolutely amazing because when you think about it, Neo's not here in the United States, XPEV is not here, Lee Autos is not, and those stocks are all over 25, 28, 30. I saw Neo today hit $48 a share. So we have this company, an OTC company that actually has the distribution rights to Chinese, two Chinese companies, two Chinese electric vehicle companies that have officially, especially Skywell, has officially made it here to the United States. So it's a really great day. And today, for the first time, it went over a dollar. And in fact, the last time I checked, it was at a dollar fifteen. So it's extremely exciting times. I have been invested since thirty cents. And if you look, this is exactly when I told people to invest. They have a lot of low speed vehicles as well, like the Euro Coupe. Um, the Urb 3 which I've seen will be like police, um, the, the vehicles used for police. And then they have the high-speed vehicles, which there's the Skywell ET5, but they have the, the Terra E, um, and then this uh, scooter, an electric scooter, which is really nice. And then they have all these service vehicles as well. Now, um, I wrote about it uh, just after it already had grown 41% on November 20th. And the price per share then was 36 cents, which is when I went ahead and bought. I did buy some uh, in the in the early 30s and then at 36 was the last time that I bought. And uh, it has been on absolute fire. Um, I'm excited to see in the future as soon as they start making sales. And I'm wondering how many of us investors are going to be looking into that company because I'm very interested in the ET5. I know some people had mentioned on like stock blogs or the stock twits, they mention um, the Terra E, they like that vehicle as well. And then I have read people say like, oh, I want one of those scooters. So I'm very excited to see the future of this company and where it goes. I do believe that it is going to be a long-term hold, maybe not as long as we expect. Uh, I do read a lot of people saying that hopefully it does get uplifted, uplisted into the NASDAQ. And for that to happen, I believe they have to be over four or five dollars per share. So as of right now at one dollar and the leadership's intention is to get it up into the NASDAQ because obviously you have two Chinese EV companies there and you're able, you know, we're able to take advantage of this at like such an early phase. And what I really am hammering home is that DSGT is just getting started. And I believe this is a good time to get in. Of course, it would have been ideal to get in even earlier. I'm lucky that I did. However, like, I don't believe it's late. I don't think it's too late. I think uh, if you have a couple thousand 
dollars sitting aside, go ahead and invest it and just wait until it gets uplifted into the NASDAQ. And at that point, it's probably going to be over $5 a share. And at that point, hopefully we can turn around and buy ourselves one of these uh, TNMAs or one of the ET5s. So you all take care, subscribe and like, that way you can keep up to date. I'm going to come out with a lot of videos. My whole intention is to just focus on YouTube and EV news, plus um, all the other things that I'm doing as well. Got big announcements coming as well. So keep in touch, stay subscribed, stay focused. The EV industry is taking off and we're going to ride this wave. Let's do it. <laughs>